Hey guys, very good morning. So, this is going to be the first my story, and I wanted to start this amazing journey with a lesson or an advice from an old man. Okay, so this is a story from last year, November or December. We were having um, uh, me and my best friend were going on morning walk, just like today. So what happened was um, we went to a riverside. Okay, there's a place called Naraj over here in our place, and we went there. So this is a, a riverside, and there's a tea stall over there. So we went to the tea stall. We sat there. We ordered some tea, and then an old man came in, and he sat there and um, started piling an orange. He took an orange out of his pocket and he started piling it off. So what happened was. Um, me and my best friend were having a conversation, and I decided, why not just talk with this old man and listen what he has to say about uh, to us, right? So we we started having that conversation, and um, with him, I initiated the conversation like, "Hello, sir. I just saw that you came in riding. So he was actually riding a bike, and then he came by, and uh, what happened was, um, he was uh, he started talking about his life, his childhood." His, uh, his school life and everything so we were just listening to him and I saw an opportunity over there so I said sir what would be your advice to your 21 year old self right so he sat there thinking for a couple of minutes and then he replied um, he said I would say two things uh, to my younger self number one is detachment detach yourself from everything like whether it's a materialistic thing, whether it's people, whether it's uh, uh, something you admire a lot, detach yourself from every single thing. Because just know the fact that everything has to go one day and you cannot do anything about it. So even if it's your family, even if it's somebody you admire a lot, everybody has to go one day. So just accept the fact that they would be going and just move on, right? So detach yourself from every single thing. Then comes... Um, the second thing is that practice Sthita Pragya. Now, what is Sthita Pragya? Sthita Pragya is a, a Sanskrit word which means remain calm in all situation. No matter what happens, remain calm. So let's say uh, you are just starting your, uh, you just started making a lot of money, right? So remain calm in that situation as well. Whether you are happy, whether you are sad, whether something really bad happened and you are panicking, just remain calm. Right? No matter what happens, remain calm in all situations. That's the second thing. So these were the two things that he mentioned. He also started sharing some uh, really good stories about how he remained calm when his mother was in the deathbed. He even said to his mother that, Ma, I know that you won't be here for long and you also know this. Right? So I say to you that I gave my best, I'm giving my best and I want you to know that I love you. So she said, she accepted it, you know, like I, I think this is very weird, but he said that to his mother and his mother really accepted it. And then after a month or so, his mother uh, passed away and and he was as calm as uh, any time, right? So. This is the thing, he, he remained calm in all situation and he started moving on even before the thing actually happened. So yeah, this was the story of an advice from an old man. A couple of things, number one is detachment, the second one is Tita Pragya. So that will be all for today's story and I will be coming back tomorrow and um, I will be telling you another story, okay? So have a great day, remain calm and detach yourself from every single thing, okay? Having said that, see you tomorrow and keep creating for a change.